Welcome to Leggett Automotive Group's first ever virtual auto show. I'm your host, Juliana Chiaviti, your automotive woman. 2022 is a special year for Leggett Automotive as it marks their 100 year anniversary and they're kicking off their celebrations with this three day auto show. This virtual event will feature new arrivals, what's coming, and EV updates from your favorite automotive brands, as well as daily exotic features. And wait, did I mention there are amazing daily giveaways live to viewers? Just wait for the on-screen prompts for your chance to win detailing packages, window tinting, paint protection, and much, much more. Check out leggit.ca slash auto show for full event details or to inquire about any vehicles featured in the event. So stay tuned and enjoy the show. We're kicking off every day with exotic features presented by our friends at Legendary Motor Car. Be sure to check out their full collection of amazing classic cars and restorations at legendarymotorcar.com. Holy cow, this thing's like being shot out of a can. 20 years ago, we started doing TV, and now Gary's convinced me we need to do this on YouTube, so here we are. Today we've got this beautiful 1980 LP400S. What a car. You guys are gonna love this story. This is an urban barn find car. The guy who we bought this car from had it sitting in his underground car garage, downtown Toronto, since the mid 90s. It was time for him to sell the car. He watched the TV show. He gave us a call. We went down there and bought it the same day, 25 minutes from our shop. The car was in great condition. All we did was paint the car to exactly the color combination that it left the factory with. The car was red. We repainted it in this Acapulco blue, restoring the car to its original color combo how Jacques Villeneuve ordered this thing new. Not the Formula One champion, his uncle, IndyCar racer and Canadian snowmobile racer Jacques Villeneuve, not to be confused with Gilles, his brother Jacques. Lamborghini built the Countach from 74 all the way to 1990 with a whole ton of different variations. This LP400S Series 2 is honestly my favorite version. I'm not a big fan of the 25th anniversary big wing you know, obnoxious looking car with the huge flares and probably an extra thousand pounds of stuff. Everyone likes this stripped down LP400 Periscope car, but in my mind, this car has just the right amount of flair so that you know at a glance this thing is a Countach. So the initial Periscope car, the LP400, they had pretty narrow tires on it. And frankly, it didn't corner that well. So they just went bananas. Check these things out. They went to a 345, 15 inch. These are the widest tires you could order at the time. All right, let's have a look at the engine here. 3.9 liter V12, what a monster. Six big Weber carbs. I mean, the thing looks badass. To get the balance of the car right, they wanted to mount the transmission as far forward as they could. So they mounted the transmission in between the two seats in front of the engine and had it run all the way through the back, through the sump, all to try and improve the handling of this car. <laughs> the, the slanted door sill really just funnels you into the seat. You know, the first thing you notice here is this giant armrest just so happens to be where the transmission sits. They were trying to get this thing as far forward as possible to balance the car well, and it just so happened to end up in the cockpit next to the driver. So dog leg pattern here with first gear being down, and they've got a good little lockout here that you're supposed to flick every time after you back out of your driveway, just so you don't accidentally stick the thing in reverse. You know, looking at the interior on this thing, it's what you'd expect. It's not perfect. It's not even good, frankly, but who cares? It's a Lamborghini Countach. 
You know, I love the dash on this thing. I don't know if it's suede or velvet or whatever, but it looks like a jewelry display. As much as the fit and finish isn't all that great on these cars, I love the interior. I love this seat, but they put you in kind of a slouching position. If you had a bad back, you really wouldn't want to take this thing on a long drive. You know, for the sheer amount of glass and the sheer number of windows on this thing, I mean, three on the door here, this is ridiculous. I don't know what they were thinking if they just like measured a hamburger, like you couldn't even order a coffee in this thing. So you did get some options here as far as climate control. You got apparently what is pretty good air conditioning and heat, all in Italian obviously, on this nice little metal instrument panel. And of course you get a big toggle for your pop-up headlights. So while the driver has a pretty narrow footbox and a nice carpeted dead pedal, the passenger just kind of gets a holy crap bar to brace your feet on down there. Listen to that. That literally sounds like 1980. Oh, yes. All right, down for first, down for first. <laughs> no power steering is a real treat in a tight parking lot. So now we get to the point where we ask the question, do you need a car like this? No. No one needs a car like this. But do you want a car like this? Everyone my dad's age had two posters on their wall, Farrah Fawcett and the Countach. And since one of those is unobtainable, yeah, you want a car just like this. At Leggett Automotive, we are proud to represent so many amazing automotive brands, and we love helping our customers find the perfect vehicle to match their lifestyle. To help you make your pick among 2022's best new arrivals, we have comprehensive vehicle features just around the corner. But first, let's take a look at the most popular vehicles in the top selling segments in Canada. As mentioned, day one of the auto show features new arrivals, Vehicles that are either all new or redesigned in 2022, but anyone considering a new vehicle should add these to their research list as well. Starting with the compact SUV segment, let's take a closer look at the most popular vehicles. First up, the Toyota RAV4. The RAV4 is the top selling compact SUV in North America, and with its comfort, style, and fuel efficiency, it isn't hard to see why. The RAV4 is available in five trims and five hybrid models, starting at just under 29,000 for gas engines and just over 33,000 for hybrid models. Coming in at a close second in the segment, the Honda CRV was the 2022 IIHS top safety pick. With an upcoming redesign expected for 2023, the CRV sees no real changes in 2022, but maintains its all around excellence. The CRV comes in nine available trims, starting at just under $31,000. Mazda has made all wheel drive standard on its full range of crossovers, starting with the 2022 CX-5. With prices beginning just over $30,000, this small SUV is known for its refined styling and driving performance. More on the all new CX-5 later in the show. The Ford Escape boasts the sportier styling introduced in the 2020 model year. Compared to the previous generation, the Escape stands lower, wider, and longer. The Escape comes in nine different models, offering both gas and hybrid options, starting at just over $29,000. Moving into the full-size pickup truck segment, we have to kick it off with the Ford F-150. The F-150 was the 2021 North American Truck of the Year and is the best-selling truck in Canada. With eight trims, and multiple cab and bed configurations, the F-150 starts at just over 34,000 and ranges all the way into the 90,000s. Next up is the Chevy Silverado, which received a significant refresh in 2022, including more advanced technologies and major improvements to the interior. Available in eight trims and multiple configurations, the Silverado starts at just over 32,000. 
Alongside the Chevy Silverado, the GMC Sierra full-size pickup is one of the best-selling vehicles in Canada year in and year out. For the 2022 model year, the truck receives a refreshed exterior and interior, as well as new trim levels, including an even more luxe Denali Ultimate variant. Starting at just over 47,000 with five available trims, there is a Sierra for everyone. We have a full feature of the Toyota Tundra coming your way in just a few minutes, but we couldn't leave it off our list of popular trucks. With a new engine and 23 configurations available, the Tundra is staking its claim in the truck segment. If you're looking for a subcompact SUV, you need to consider these amazing vehicles. Starting with the Honda HRV. The HRV is the perfect blend of comfort and tech features. This subcompact SUV is unchanged in 2022, while Honda gears up for an all new 2023 HRV. Starting at just over 26,000 and available in four trims, the HRV is perfect for those looking for a comfortable and reliable small SUV. The Toyota CHR is the smallest of Toyota's crossover offerings, positioned below the RAV4 and Highlander. Unlike most vehicles marketed as SUVs, the CHR is exclusively offered with front wheel drive, but makes up for the lack of all wheel drive options with generous standard features and great overall value. The CHR comes in three models and starts at just over $26,000. Since its February 2020 debut, Seltos has risen to be one of Kia's strongest sellers in a highly competitive segment. The 2022 Kia Seltos arrives with more standard safety technology and refined styling. The Seltos comes in six trim options and starts at just under $24,000. From the moment you step into the driver's seat, the compact versatility of the 2022 Mazda CX-3 puts you in control of the day ahead. The CX-3 is the smallest of Mazda's crossover SUVs, positioned below the CX-30, CX-5, and CX-9. It was introduced for the 2016 model year and has since seen a slight facelift and the addition of standard driver assist active safety features. The CX-3 comes in three trim options, which start at just over $21,000. Don't call the Encore GX just another Encore. The similarly named Buick subcompact SUVs are two distinct models and not variations of one another. The GX, which is the bigger of the two models, has become the brand's bestseller in the first year it was issued, snatching the crown from the original Encore. Available in three models, the Encore starts at just under $29,000. And for our daily commuters out there, let's take a look at the leading compact cars. A car that needs no introduction, the Honda Civic is all new in 2022. As with its predecessors, the 2022 Civic aims to provide affordable, reliable, efficient motoring for the masses. More on the all new Civic later in the show. Chances are when you think of compact sedans, one that first comes to mind is the Toyota Corolla. The popular car is now available as a hatchback and as a hybrid sedan. Currently in its 12th generation and starting at just under $20,000, the Corolla sees minor changes for the 2022 model year. The Mazda 3 was named the AJAC Canadian Car of the Year in 2021. No small feat when you're competing against the Civic and Corolla. The model was last redesigned for 2019 and for 2022 is available as a sedan and hatchback slotting under the mid-size Mazda 6 sedan. The Mazda 3 comes in three models and starts at just over $21,000. The Kia Forte has been redesigned in 2022 with fresh styling and new driver assist technologies. And being a Kia, the Forte has an impressive warranty and amazing lease programs. More on the redesigned Forte in our full vehicle feature later in the show. But if you need something larger, you want to check out these mid-size SUVs. The Honda Pilot is no newcomer, but its performance, comfortable ride, Clever interior design and great value make it an obvious contender for anyone shopping for three row SUVs. The Pilot starts at just over $46,000 and is available in four gas models and three hybrid models. The three row SUV segment wouldn't be what it is today without the Toyota Highlander, providing a flexible three row interior and Toyota's value and dependability. The Highlander starts at $44,570 
and is available in four gas models and three hybrid models. Redesigned in 2021, the Kia Sorento is bolder and more chiseled with fresh styling and improved interior. The Sorento boasts amazing fuel efficiency and is backed by Kia's impressive warranty. The Sorento starts at just under $35,000 and is available in six trims. Terrific build quality is expected of a Honda and the Passport delivers. Introduced in 2019, the Passport has undergone a rugged refresh for 2022. With a generous amount of cargo space and passenger accommodations, this vehicle is supremely practical. Starting at just over $45,000, the Passport is available in three trims. The Ford Explorer is an archetype. In the model line's three plus decades of existence, it has helped cultivate the massive popularity of SUVs. This three row midsize SUV slots above the edge and below the Expedition in Ford's SUV lineup. Now in its sixth generation, the Explorer is available in six trims and starts at just under $47,000. And we can't forget about the luxurious yet functional 2022 Mazda CX-9, which offers a sophisticated driving experience. Adored for its refined styling and amazing tech features, and now with standard all-wheel drive, the CX-9 is available in five trims and starts at just under $41,000. With so many amazing choices in each vehicle segment, making the choice that's right for you can be difficult. That's why we offer a comprehensive vehicle comparison tool where you can compare pricing, photos, specs, and even see a full list of advantages. Check out leggit.ca slash compare to aid your vehicle research. Up next, giveaways and vehicle features, so don't go away. And now on to our new arrivals. I'm Juliana Chiaviti, your automotive woman, and this is your 2022 Cadillac Escalade. When it comes to large and lavish transportation, it really doesn't get any better than the Cadillac Escalade, which was fully redesigned in 2021. This next generation Escalade is very impressive with both luxury features and technology, including several upgrades that came with the redesign. Having just been redesigned last year, the 2022 Escalade doesn't have major changes to its overall look but it does have that signature Escalade design, which is bold and unapologetic no matter which trim level you choose, and so is its price tag, starting at just over $90,000. Let's explore why it's worth every penny. The standard 6.2 liter 420 horsepower V8 is paired with an intelligent 10-speed automatic transmission that moves through gears in a smooth, efficient fashion. Engine technology such as continuously variable valve timing, direct injection, and dynamic fuel management also help ensure fuel is harnessed efficiently. Also available in 3-liter diesel, combined city and highway fuel economy stands at 10.5 liters per 100 kilometers and 14.7 liters per 100 kilometers for the 6.2-liter V8. Features we love include a 38-inch curved OLED diagonal display, available night vision, available AKG 36-speaker audio system. The 2022 Escalade also features Super Cruise, the first true hands-free driver-assisted technology, which is compatible with select highways. Super Cruise is now enhanced with all new automatic lane change functionality one of the many driver assistance elements incorporated into the 2022 Escalade. We have extensively tested this feature and we absolutely love it. If you are a heavy packer and worried about storage space, don't be. The Escalade delivers 121 cubic feet of storage and a whopping 142 cubic feet in the ESV version. So you're ready to take on 
any adventure. Equipped with wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, connectivity has never been better, and the rear entertainment system provides screen sharing ability for your device to the large 10-inch media screens. And in terms of safety, features buckle up and drive with confidence. A whole suite of leading edge safety and driver assisted features come standard in the Escalade. Front pedestrian braking, automatic emergency braking, forward collision alert, safety alert seating, HD rear vision camera, team driver system, vehicle diagnostics, and rear park assist. And that is your 2022 Escalade. I'm Julianne Chiaviti, your automotive woman, and this is your Corvette Stingray. This is the Corvette Stingray C8R edition, only one of 1,000 produced worldwide. Featuring a new mid-engine design, Corvette puts its power to the pavement better than ever. It's supremely capable on a racetrack, and given its performance, its value simply cannot be matched. Available in two colors, Accelerate Yellow and Hypersonic Gray, this masterwork was designed to commemorate Corvette Racing's winning 2020 season, featuring the same colors as their team cars. While this is the special C8R edition, standard C8 models feature the same 6.2 liter V8 mid-engine that puts out a staggering 495 horsepower and 470 pound-feet of torque, making this the most powerful Stingray ever produced. There are three available trims, the 1LT, 2LT, and 3LT, each offering both coupe and convertible options. Features we love include a performance data recorder that enables drivers to measure all aspects of their driving, coming standard on the 2LT and 3LT trims. Available front lift system raising the front of the car almost two inches in less than three seconds at low speeds so you can clear low obstacles like speed bumps or steep driveways. The system also remembers up to 1,000 GPS locations for ultimate convenience and safe driving. Driver mode selector lets you electronically change up to 12 performance variables on screen to ready your Stingray for any road. The C8 has a number of driving upgrades, including improved visibility, responsiveness, and handling, better rear weight distribution, and a more aerodynamic design to improve performance, and efficiency. While the new C8 has a much smaller trunk than its predecessor, the C7, it now also has a front end trunk. The cockpit has been redone with a heavy dose of inspiration from both modern fighter jets and single seat race cars. With seamless integration and a cutting edge command center, Corvette features the Chevrolet infotainment system with a 12 inch digital driver cluster display. Plus, Technologies like wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto compatibility make this car super connected. This is your Corvette Stingray. I'm here with the Acura RDX PMC Limited Edition. Music 
Acura made this vehicle available via order only special release in February 2022. There are only 200 produced worldwide with 15 made available to the Canadian market. So what makes this RDX so special? Well, PMC stands for Performance Manufacturing Center, which is where Acura builds their NSX supercar. All 200 units were assembled by hand at the Acura PMC facility. But that's not the only thing it shares with the NSX. Check out this Long Beach Blue Pearl Paint, which is otherwise only available on the NSX. Starting at $61,500, the PMC edition comes at a small premium compared to the standard RDX. But we think the exclusivity and styling updates make it worth every penny. The engine is the same two liter four cylinder turbocharged engine that you'll find in the standard RDX, which is good for 272 horsepower and accelerates this small luxury SUV from zero to 60 in seven seconds. When it comes to the PMC edition, it's all about the details. Features we love include a color match grille, 20 inch 15 spoke wheels, a unique production number badge, black gloss accents, and blue interior stitching. The RDX PMC edition also comes loaded with technology featuring wireless charging, a 16 speaker, 710 watt sound system, including four ceiling mounted speakers for true surround sound and a heads up display. Safety features include four collision warning, lane departure and road departure warning, and Acura's exclusive super handling all wheel drive system. This is your Acura RDX PMC edition. Legate Automotive Group has recently launched their Drive Life initiative, ensuring every customer gets into the perfect car to fit their lifestyle. To find out more about how they're putting you in the driver's seat, visit legate.ca slash drive life. We all take different roads to get where life takes us, but it's the journey of getting there that tells some of life's best stories. Start your next journey with Legate Automotive Group. We make finding your dream vehicle a breeze. Get started from the comfort of your own home by browsing our new and pre-owned inventory from your computer, tablet, or mobile device. We offer transparent pricing so you know exactly what you'll pay, whether you choose cash, lease, or finance. Choose the accessories that suit your lifestyle. Then add extra peace of mind with a protection plan that meets your needs. If you choose a lease or finance option, it's easy to manage your pre-approval with a simple and secure credit application. Once you're ready, you can book a test drive or place a deposit to reserve your vehicle. If you still need more time to review, save your deal for later and pick up right where you left off. Our staff is here to serve you, whether it's online or at the dealership. Endless roads, endless possibilities. Leg it. Drive life. I'm Juliana Chiavitti, your automotive woman, and this is the 2022 Toyota Tundra. Competing against the big three when it comes to pickup trucks is anything but easy. 
but the Toyota Tundra has held its own in the segment for some 20 years now. And with the debut of the new third generation Tundra, it doesn't look like they are shying away from that fight anytime soon. The Tundra is redesigned in 2022 and seems to offer a little something fresh for just about everyone. Truck talk normally begins with what's under the hood. Toyota is embracing the new rather than the traditional. They have stopped producing the truck with a V8 engine, but they've added an all new standard 3.5 liter twin turbo V6 that outputs 389 horsepower and 437 pound feet of torque. The Tundra uses 87 octane gas, which should help your wallets and offers fuel economy in the range of 13.1 liter per 100 kilometers in the city and 10.1 liters per 100 kilometers on the highway. The 2022 Tundra was released in Canada this past December and starts at just under $45,000 and comes available in double cab and crew max and has several available trims. Both sizes are outstanding four-door options with the double cab available in 6.5 or 8.1 foot bed configurations, while the Crew Max offers 5.5 and 6.5 foot beds. Features we love include a new 10-speed direct shift automatic transmission, towing capacity of up to 12,000 pounds, and a premium interior designed to offer the utmost comfort and sophistication. In terms of tech and connectivity, the Tundra offers the all new Toyota multimedia system and features an eight inch or 14 inch HD touchscreen display with wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. The Drive Connect package includes cloud navigation, intelligent assist and destination assist to elevate your driving experience and features like QI wireless charging give you convenience while on the go. The Tundra also offers impressive driver assistance, including trailer backup guidance with straight path assist, a 360 degree camera, blind spot monitoring, and Toyota Safety Sense, which features pre-collision system for pedestrians and bicycles, automatic high beams, lane departure alert with a steering assist and road edge detection, full speed range dynamic radar cruise control and lane tracing assist. This is your 2022 Toyota Tundra. I'm Juliana Chiavitti, your automotive woman, and this is the 2022 Mazda CX-5. In 2021, Mazda announced that their iActive all-wheel drive will now be standard on all upcoming CX models, making them the only manufacturer other than Subaru to offer standard all-wheel drive on their full crossover lineup. We are here with the first of those models, the 2022 Mazda CX-5, which includes sophisticated styling updates that heighten the CX-5's appeal, significant vehicle dynamic improvements to elevate the driving experience, and as mentioned, standard iActive all-wheel drive. The Mazda CX-5 has been adored by many since it debuted nearly a decade ago. It quickly earned recognition for combining outstanding design and quality craftsmanship with excellent performance and fuel efficiency. New to the Canadian market as of January, the all-new CX-5 starts at just over $30,000 and is available in six trims. GX, GS, Kuro, GT, support design and signature. This compact SUV received a significant facelift starting with the updated and upgraded headlights and moving 
to the new gloss black chain link style designed grille. Towards the back of the vehicle, the tail lights have also been updated and upgraded, giving it a sporty flair. Underneath the hood, Mazda has stuck with their tried and true 2.5 liter four cylinder engine, putting out 187 horsepower and 186 pound feet of torque. However, the new CX-5 also offers an upgrade to a four cylinder turbo available only on the sport design and signature trims, which increases the output to 227 horsepower and 310 pound feet of torque. And despite the all wheel drive system, the vehicle still maintains fantastic fuel efficiency of 7.9 liters per 100 kilometers on the highway. Features we love include ample cargo space of 1,680 liters behind the front seat and 871 liters behind the rear seats. Available wireless phone charging, updated safety features, and a redesigned exterior. In terms of tech and connectivity, the CX-5 features Mazda's connected infotainment system and includes Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. There are several updated safety features, including advanced blind spot monitoring, rear cross-traffic alert, Mazda Raider cruise control with stop and go function, lane keep assist, lane departure warning, and pedestrian detection. The all new CX-5 firmly takes its spot in the compact SUV segment alongside the Toyota RAV4 and Honda CRV. This is your all new Mazda CX-5. I'm Juliana Chiaviti, and this is the 2022 Toyota Corolla Cross. It's once again time to get excited about a vehicle named Corolla. This is the 2022 Toyota Corolla Cross built on the same platform as the Toyota Corolla, Prius, and the Lexus UX. This little guy finally positions Toyota to compete in the small SUV space versus names like the Honda HRV, Kia Seltos, Subaru Crosstrek, and Chevrolet Trax. For added context, the Corolla Cross falls size wise between the Toyota RAV4 and the smaller Toyota CHR. But unlike the front wheel drive only CHR, the Corolla Cross can be upgraded to all wheel drive. Starting at just under $25,000, your modestly priced weekend vehicle has arrived. Among small SUVs, the Corolla Cross is one of the more fuel efficient options on par with the Subaru Crosstrek and edging out the Chevrolet Trax and Hyundai Kona at 7.8 liters per 100 kilometers combined. And while the small SUV segment is not known for their speed, the Corolla Cross delivers more than adequate power from its two liter dynamic force engine that puts out 169 horsepower using their relatively new direct shift CVT transmission. Features we love include a premium interior that features standard heated seats and a surprising 608 liters of cargo space. Choice of single or dual zone automatic climbing controls, available heated leather wrapped steering wheel, and an available moonroof for stargazing or soaking in the sun. And both front wheel drive and all wheel drive configurations to suit all your driving needs. The Corolla Cross is packed with technology and offers Apple CarPlay and Android Auto as standard. It also features a 4.2 inch color TFT multi-information display and available features including an eight inch touchscreen display, nine speakers, JBL audio, smart key with push start button, a backup camera system, and QI wireless charging. Toyota also offers a host of connected services, including remote safety connect, 
Service Connect and Destination Assist to enhance your driving experience. Lastly, Toyota has improved its driver assistance with Toyota Safety Sense 2.0, which features a pre-collision system with pedestrian and bicycle detection, automatic high beams, lane departure alert with steering assist, and road edge detection. Full speed dynamic radar cruise control and lane tracing assist. This is your 2022 Toyota Corolla Cross. making minivans cool again, or maybe for the first time. This is the Kia Carnival. You may know the Kia minivan as the Sedona, but no longer. The Sedona was a name only used in North American markets. Everywhere else in the world, it was called the Carnival. When Kia redesigned their minivan in 2022, they finally decided to give it the Carnival name. Starting at just under $35,000 and ranging all the way into the 60s, the Kia Carnival is a self-proclaimed LUV or life utility vehicle. I guess they really didn't want to call it a minivan. <laughs> Titles aside, this thing is loaded with luxury family-friendly features that you will L-U-V love. The vehicle behind me today is the top trim level, the Carnival SX, and comes in just over $50,000. But with that price tag comes a ton of amazing features. Kia has made every effort to ensure this isn't another doll minivan, starting with the front grille, which is very expressive. Black wheels are also standard on the Carnival. And above the rear wheels is a silver blade with a diamond pattern, which serves no purpose aside from looking cool. But the interior of this minivan is where it really impresses us. We love the available middle row VIP lounge seats that can be fully reclined for maximum comfort. They also have an available power footrest. Features we love include heated and cooled second row seating, separate rear climate control, multiple charging options in the front and rear, available second row entertainment screens with screen sharing capabilities and built-in apps like Netflix and YouTube. Apple CarPlay and Android Auto come standard and two available sunroofs. For the adventures and sporty families, the Carnival has great cargo space, even with the full third row seating in place. The third row seating does of course fold down, creating a much bigger cargo area. The Carnival is equipped with a long list of standard driver assisted features to make your job behind the wheel easier, including forward collision warning, pedestrian detection, emergency braking, driver drowsiness monitoring, rear cross traffic alert, lane departure warning, and lane keep assist. The minivan also has safe exit assistance to ensure the safety of passengers exiting from the back doors. This is your 2022 Kia Carnival. I'm Juliana Chiaviti, and this is your 2022 Kia Forte. For 2022, Kia has redesigned the Forte with fresh styling and new tech to keep it in competition with other comparable vehicles in its class. New to the 2022 Forte is an updated grille, 
stylish exterior lights, redesigned front and rear bumper, new wheel designs, and a new rear spoiler. In the GT lines, we see new LED focus lamps built into the lower grille. The GT line also comes with an upgraded LED taillight system. The redesigned Forte starts at just over $18,000 and is perfect for the person looking for a stylish small sedan. Let's take a look at some other features. The engine delivers 147 horsepower and 132 pound-feet of torque. The second option for the driver looking for something a little bit more sporty and responsive receives a 1.6-liter turbocharged four-cylinder engine available only to the GT line, delivering 201 horsepower and 195 pound-feet of torque. Inside all four Tame models, you will see an updated larger 4.2-inch LCD cluster. The 8-inch infotainment center is still standard with available 10 and a quarter inch options. Kia has gone without the traditional parking brake and instead went with an electronic one. The features we love in the new Forte include advanced safety features, excellent fuel economy, Uvo Intelligence and Kia Connect. Sport seats with heated front and rear seats, as well as ventilated front seats. The Forte comes with the best lease program in its class, plus a five-year, 100,000-kilometer comprehensive warranty, making it extremely attractive option for value and reliability. The Forte's driver safety assist system includes advanced smart cruise control, highway drive and lane keep assist, forward collision avoidance, and blind spot detection. You will also find additional features like rear cross traffic alerts, tire pressure monitoring, driver attention alerts, high beam assist, and much more. Stay connected in your Kia Forte with wireless phone charging, available 10 and a quarter inch display with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, premium Harman Kardon sound and built-in navigation to keep you headed in the right direction. This is your redesigned Forte. I'm Juliana Chiaviti, your automotive woman, and this is the 2022 Ford Bronco. In 1965, Ford Motor Company introduced the Bronco, North America's first SUV. The SUV that set the standard for 4x4 capabilities. In the summer of 2020, after a 25-year hiatus, the Ford Bronco is doing it again. If something is gonna be called a Bronco, it better be able to live up to the name with two new color options, special edition models, and much, much more to come on the horizon. The Ford Bronco is ready to push boundaries. Let's check out the future of off-roading. Built for the thrill seeker, the Sightseer and the Day Tripper. The new Bronco comes in two different sizes, the Bronco and the smaller Bronco Sport shown here. To enable your journey into the outdoors, this rugged build puts utility in the foreground with a purposeful design that includes available easy to clean surfaces and a ton of interior space thanks to the roomy architecture of the safari style roof. The Bronco Sport shares engine options with the Escape featuring two turbocharged choices. The first option is the standard 1.5 liter EcoBoost three cylinder with four x four, which produces 181 horsepower and 190 pound feet of torque. The other, a two liter EcoBoost four cylinder that produces 245 horsepower and 275 pound feet of torque. The Bronco Sport comes available in six different models starting at around $33,000. The features we love include goat mode, 
No, we don't mean Tom Brady. We mean GOAT, as in goes over any type of terrain. There are five standard GOAT modes, sand, slippery, sport, eco, and normal. The Badlands model comes with two additional modes, mud and rocks and rock crawl. Our second favorite feature includes a high performance off-road stability suspension system tested in the wild and optimized to help drivers maintain vehicle composure while aggressively taking on rugged terrain. And finally, standard 4x4 across the Bronco Sport lineup to help you battle the elements on your epic adventures. The Bronco features an available 4Pass performance app with off-road navigation, a class exclusive feature that allows off-roaders to easily plan, navigate, and share their off-road adventures. No other mobile app experience integrates professionally curated terrain content, third-party map files, and in-vehicle navigation. Also available in the 2022 Ford Bronco is a Sync 3 infotainment center and other technologies to keep you connected to your vehicle and safety features such as auto high beam headlamps, blind spot information system, lane keeping system, pre-collision assist, and a rear view camera with washer. This is your 2022 Ford Bronco. The Ford Maverick is a new kind of pickup. Versatile and capable. Built for makers and doers. Stunningly fuel efficient and built for tough. It's the truck for people who never knew they needed a truck. Here's everything you need to know about the all new Ford Maverick in just three minutes. Maverick is the first ever standard full hybrid truck. Maverick comes standard as a five passenger, four door pickup available in XL, XLT, and Lariat trim levels. The standard 2.5 liter hybrid has a targeted EPA estimated rating of 40 miles per gallon in the city and 500 miles of range on a single tank of gas. The truck bed is a maker space. This flex bed system offers all kinds of organization and DIY solutions. 
like vertical and horizontal slots for two by four and two by six boards that you can use to build your own bike racks, service bed dividers, or any number of other solutions. A multi-position tailgate and 10 available tie downs to secure your items. Two available 110 volt outlets, one in the cabin and one in the bed, can power phones, tools, and electronics. And a standard electric 12 volt DIY pre-wire package in the bed can be used for wiring lights and a four and a half foot bed. Six feet with the tailgate down can help haul bikes, furniture, or that next DIY project you're working on. Maverick has a lower ride height, which makes getting in and out a breeze. And most adults can reach over the side and easily grab whatever you need. It has a max payload capacity of 1,500 pounds and standard towing capacity of 2,000 pounds. And of course, Maverick is built for tough. The available two liter EcoBoost engine, which provides optional all wheel drive, also has an available max towing package of 4,000 pounds. Maverick is built with smart technology like a standard embedded modem, which allows you to start, lock, and unlock your vehicle from your Ford Pass app. The standard eight inch touchscreen also provides seamless integration with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Five selectable drive modes to help enhance performance and confidence in various driving conditions. It has Ford Copilot 360 technology like standard automatic emergency braking and auto high beams as well as available adaptive cruise control with stop and go, lane centering, and evasive steering assist capabilities. This truck was designed with smart storage solutions to accommodate how people live. Like there's a place to store a tall one liter water bottle. Store your gear in the large bins under the rear seat, door pockets for stashing laptops or tablets, and bed storage for things like tools or rope. Maverick boasts a tight turning radius and compact size for easy driving and parking around the city. Maverick has city maneuverability with truck functionality. The truck is ingeniously designed to be customized inside and out to suit your lifestyle. And it delivers on the built Ford Tough durability and capability you expect. We had an incredible development team behind this new Civic, and now I'm happy to share with you key elements of what they created. Inspired by classic elements of past Civics, you can really see how Civic's new thin and light body has taken shape. We've stretched the wheelbase and adopted a cleaner, more sophisticated look. As you can see, this new front end emphasizes its low and wide stance. With strong horizontal elements, new LED headlight graphics, and a more upright grille. Lowering the hood and belt line emphasize Civic's wheels and tires. We've also moved the A-pillars back about two inches together with a longer hood for a more premium silhouette. These changes also add visual stability and give Civic a planted sporty stance that's amplified by a sharp center character line that runs the length of the vehicle and this upswept character line that adds a sense of motion even when standing still. In back, the low and wide stance gives Civic a planted look that communicates its performance capabilities. Our development team widened the rear track for a more muscular stance, while the new taillight graphics emphasize the width of the car. The upswept deck lid not only adds to Civic's sportier look functionally, it improves dynamic stability and aero efficiency. Once inside, you can really see our human-centered design philosophy take shape. Sitting in this car reminds me of my first Honda, a 1991 Civic, because the overall design is classic Honda. The interior is totally transformed with its simple ergonomics and exceptional visibility, creating a refreshingly clean and uncluttered view of the road ahead. Those thin pulled back A-pillars Low cowl and door mounted side mirrors create a panoramic view with an overwhelming feeling of openness. This uncluttered look is augmented by a wide instrument panel with minimal cut lines. High quality materials are used throughout with a special emphasis on key customer touch points and close attention to the action of the switch gear. This new finish on the center console retains a premium look but resists fingerprints. 
And my favorite part of Civic's all new interior is this metal honeycomb mesh panel that spans the dash. It isn't just cool looking, it hides the air vents for a fresh and clean design. Another classic Honda value is simple to use. And our interior design team created this cabin with an intense focus on simplifying things. Everything should fall into place when you get into a Honda, so everything is where you expect it to be. We've prioritized functions that are frequently used, such as audio volume, making it easily accessible by either the left hand with the steering wheel control or the right hand with a no-look physical volume control knob that's intuitive to use. Even the shifter is canted slightly toward the driver to improve the user experience. And at the center of the Civic's instrument panel is a new 9-inch touchscreen with the Turing trim. This system has been improved with an eye toward quicker recognition, communicating accurate information in the shortest amount of time and intuitive operation, enabling the driver to operate it smoothly with a simple layout and graphics, and key functions available with fewer layers. Plus, for the first time on Civic, wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto integration are available. And the Touring trim level is equipped with a 12-speaker, Bose Premium Audio Sound System that sounds truly amazing. The driver's instruments are also digital, a first for Civic, making it simple for drivers to customize the readout and display as they like. And check out this cool bit function. As part of Civic's new all-digital dash for the Touring trim, the on-off status of the vehicle's lights are shown on the display, including brake lights and turn signals. Of course, we're talking Civic, so we wanted to make it the most fun to drive Civic we've ever made. Under the skin, the suspension, steering, and brakes have all been optimized to further improve the legendary best-in-class handling and ride comfort, something you'll notice the moment you take the wheel. This 11th gen model advances the already class-leading body construction and materials to reduce noise and vibration and elevate the driving experience. Powertrain refinements improve performance, fuel economy ratings, and drivability. And Civic's 1.5 liter turbocharged four cylinder gets a power boost to 180 horsepower and 177 pounds feet of torque. Careful refinements to the powertrain also help reduce noise and vibration. We've also made changes to the CVT transmission to make the Civic even more responsive and refined. And we've added available drive modes, including Civic's first sport mode. Importantly, these updates to Civic's powertrains have resulted in improved fuel efficiency, even with the additional power from the turbo engine. We've also enhanced our Honda Sensing suite of safety and driver assistive technology through the use of a single camera system that expands the view. And we've added new features like traffic sign recognition, traffic jam assist, and low speed braking control. There you have it. Honda's all-new 2022 Civic has been created with an intense focus on the brand's timeless values and design philosophy, augmented by intuitive technologies. The result is a Civic that raises the bar in every way. So the 2019 Passport was a hit, but what we're going to show you today for the 22 model Passport is really going to excite customers. And the first thing that they're going to see is the new front end styling. From the A pillars forward, there's new sheet metal, new fenders, a new hood. Yeah, I love and, this new hood. And then the bold front styling with the big grille really represents that off-road rugged feeling and look as well. All right, so I love the new front end styling. It echoes some of the ruggedness that you were talking about. What about here in the back? Yeah, for sure. So we didn't stop at the front. We brought it all the way to the back too. Customers are gonna get a new uh, restyled rear bumper and restyled dual exhaust tips as well. And the exhaust tips are more circular, but they really represent that more performance look too. It's great. All right, so one of the first things I noticed about this Passport is there's a Trail Sport badge on the front. Tell me about that. Yeah, good eye. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Trail Sport represents 50 plus years of Honda's off-road rugged capabilities from our motorcycles, ATVs, and side-by-sides. And the Trail Sport, which will be first introduced on the 22 model Passport, advances our rugged direction in the off-road category. 
I've also noticed that there's a really cool orange to it. it seems like kind of a signature color. The orange color uh, applies to the Trail Sport Edition. Uh, you'll see some of the orange coloring uh, very subtle on the interior of the vehicle. First thing the customer will be met with is the Trail Sport signature embroidered on the headrest, some orange stitching on the seats, the steering wheel throughout the rear cabin. We also have some Trail Sport branded rubber mats. Console materials are slightly updated for easier cleaning. So when the driver's out on the weekend, trekking in the wild or overlanding, bringing all the dirt in, it's kind of easier to wash down and clean up. To uh, reinforce some of the adventurous feeling of it, um, we did apply some additional styling for the Trail Sport. Um, you'll notice some of the uh, inlay on the grill as well as the uh, skid garnish and the roof rails are painted pewter finish as well as the wheels which will be unique to trail sport so i love what i'm looking at here essentially this is a project car right that is correct bradley so we call this the honda rugged roads project vehicle and this represents the future direction of where we're taking trail sport for future models to come we wanted to highlight some of the future capabilities and features that will come to the Trail Sport models. Okay. Um, and one of the things that we wanted to show off was the front recovery points. Cool. Um, these were designed and developed and fabricated in-house with our Honda R&D engineers. We also painted it the signature Trail Sport color orange, which is kind of nice. Yeah. Uh, additionally, we developed in-house and made the front skid plates. It's made of three millimeter high strength steel. So when you're overlanding or traversing certain terrains, the last thing you want is a rock puncturing any of those important things for you to get back home safely. Yeah. And as you can see here, we have increased ground clearance. Um, additionally, with the more aggressive tires you'll see on here, customers will be able to apply the HPD post-production parts on the vehicle. So as you can see here, we have the uh, fender flares and the signature black HPD wheels. And then I see uh, something giant on top of the vehicle. We wanted to create a very authentic build. So we've worked with John DZ Adventuring. He is a 19 model year Honda Passport owner. Uh, he does this on the weekend. Right, right. We tapped him to get some guidance on like, how will we create a very authentic overlanding build? What are the things that you need? So a lot of the applications that apply for the future trail sport features that I showed, you also have the full size spare wheel in the back here. And with this particular uh, swing carrier, there's a table built in. So I love you, that, that's so smart. Yeah, so when you get to your campsite, you can pull it out, you can cook on top, you can eat off of it, which is kind of neat. And then the roof nest on here, so we do have a rooftop tent. So when you're traveling hundreds of miles to get to your destination, the last thing you want to do is have another you're out there with all the poles and you're exhausted and you're like no exactly so you just pop that thing up ladder falls out and then you got your little home for the uh, weekend um, on your uh, overlanding trip dude you guys knocked it out of the park on this project i love the way it looks thank you um it's been a long day though if you don't mind i'm gonna go test out that rooftop tent just watch out for the rattlesnakes From myself and everyone at Leggett Automotive Group, a thank you for watching. We look forward to seeing you again tomorrow for more amazing car features. And don't forget about our daily giveaways.